So normally, we like to leave the sports stuff to sports director James Sick. <laughs> but Orlando's latest sports team is gearing up for a big challenge. That's right. The Orlando Squeeze is a pro pickleball team, and they are gearing up for Major League Pickleball's Daytona <laughs> Tournament tomorrow. News 6's Emily McLeod was at the team's practice today in Holly Hill. Pickleball teams from all over the country, including the Orlando Squeeze, will be at Holly Hill this weekend competing in the MLP tournament. It's definitely really exciting to kind of um, really get out there, compete, uh, be loud, cheer, and, and really uh, have fun out there. This is Bobby Oshiro's second MLP tournament with the Orlando Squeeze. She says their number one goal heading into the tournament is making sure they're prepared. Um, getting a lot of good hits in, you know, making sure we're, we're comfortable, we're, we're here for each other, we're supportive. Um, and, and at the end of the day, you know, going out there, trying, the, uh, trying our best. And, you know, uh, at the end of the day, win or lose, we, we stick together as a team. This is Major League Pickleball's second tournament of the 2023 season. 24 teams will battle it out among two divisions, Premier and Challenger level. Nearly 100 players from Chicago to Atlanta to Orlando will participate in this weekend's tournament. I think, to be honest, I really think that's what pickleball is all about because it brings a lot of different people together. It brings a lot of different cultures together. You get a lot of people from different states coming together um, to Florida. The Orlando Squeeze also has players from all over the country. While Oshiro is from South Florida, her other teammates are from Utah and California. Orange Squeeze's co-owner Ryan DeVos has another connection to Orlando sports. His family owns the Orlando Magic. DeVos says they've spent a lot of time practicing ahead of the competition. We were able to actually bring everybody together, which all of our players live in different parts of the country. Uh, so to be able to spend a little time getting used to each other, super helpful. Uh, and hopefully we'll be able to show show, show those results on the, on the court tomorrow. DeVos says part of pickleball's magic is the sports accessibility. You don't need to be training in, you know, like tennis for multiple years. Uh, you can jump in, play in 45 minutes. To find out how to purchase tickets or watch the tournament, you can head to our website, clickorlando.com. In Volusia County, Emily McLeod, Getting Results, News 6.